pega de mi cuarto, pero no gato mucho. 25 pesos para un, para un padre en un... I don't know what I'm saying. It's over. I tried, but I ain't Latin enough. I'm too New York Rican. Hi, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. It's Introducing Jinx. And today, I'm going to be unboxing one of my favorite YouTubers. It's my Ray Ray Khaled. And I love watching her videos. I love watching Monica Style Muse. Those who are my favorite YouTubers, I could like binge watch their videos. And I'm super excited. So if you guys want to see this unboxing and see how I created this look, then keep on watching. We're starting off with the brows and the foundation already done the cover fx contour kit in g light media I use g10 which is this shade right here this is basically to mute out my eye pack that right onto the lids i put a little bit of this underneath my brow this is like for me the perfect concealer to clean up my brow area i'm gonna blend out that lid with my finger Use the CoverGirl Professional Loose Powder in 110. Just like that, your eyelids are set. Time for the moment you guys all been waiting for. Time to unbox this package. And it's a collab with It's My Ray Ray. This is what the box looks like from BH Cosmetics. I did see previous videos as to what the palette looks like. I'm hoping that it comes in some pink packaging. Hopefully it's not just PR packaging and it's for all the customers. I'm use these scissors to open up the box. I'm trying to be careful because I don't want to mess up whatever's inside of the box. And I'm really happy because I started off with BH Cosmetics like for my freelance makeup kit. I purchased a bunch of foundations from BH Cosmetics because they make it so easy for you and affordable for you to start off doing your makeup. And I can see that it's not in the beautiful like pink box that I thought it was going to come in. That's just PR packaging, I guess. But whatever. This is what the box of the makeup brushes look like by It's My Ray Ray. I noticed like right off the bat that is thick packaging so I'm really excited it looks luxury it has that like, rose gold champagne vibe you know like your iPhone type vibe it has a nine piece brush set it has a powder brush a dual blush and bronzer brush tapered contour brush highlight brush dual blending and br highlighting brush fluffy blending brush smudge shadow brush long shadow brush and smudge liner brush BH Cosmetics we go all out they be really packaging their brushes do you see this it comes all wrapped up if you don't know, this is how BH Cosmetics does. So these are what the makeup brushes look like. Oh my gosh, so far they feel so soft. Definitely like not gonna be stabbing your face. If you guys want details on what other brushes I'm using in this video, let me know. Ask any questions that you got down below. So this is the box of the It's My Ray Ray. Eyeshadow, highlight, and contour palette. Take off this packaging nice material open it up like this and like this there's like a clear part and it's taped onto it so you can like leave that on to like protect your palette from getting so messy i'm looking at these shades and i'm like what that shadow was like Whoa. so these are what the eyeshadow looks like in the palette there's 10 matte shades and it has one two three five like shimmery shades oh my god i'm so excited i'm a neutrals lover and on top of that i've been looking for a palette that has like a matte red so first i'm gonna go into mousse angled fluffy brush i'm just going right underneath whoa i did not expect mousse to be that pigmented i probably did like two pats into the pan like for real but okay so now i'm gonna go into the other side and I thought it was like a much lighter brown, but it's not. I raise brushes and I'm debating, like in my mind, I'm debating whether I want to use this highlight brush for highlight. I am. I am actually. A better highlighting brush. I've been using a blending brush for my highlighter. So I think that brush would be amazing. I'm really excited. Wow, this is so soft. Alrighty, so I'm using Ray Ray's blending brush and I'm just blending all of that out. And as you can see, it is working its magic. And now I'm going to go with the other side and I do that once more so I'm gonna do that again with, you see that no effort 
MAC 217. And I'm gonna go into Control Freak. This color right here. You can see I pick up some of that. Look at that, pigment. So I'm gonna bring that right underneath that crease. I already knew what she was doing. Dead serious. It's like she set this up so that these colors could work so well together. You know what I mean? Damn, I really like Control Freak. Like it is a brown but has like somewhat of a reddish undertone in a sense. I don't know if it's picking up on camera but I like it. I like that. How Trey Songs be saying it. I like that. It doesn't even like look like I really touched those. Go into Sunset. Sunset is on the fallout side. Make sure tapping that excess off of your brush. I'm gonna go in the outer V which is this part of my eye. Funny story about Ray. I've been following her for such a long time. She used to live in New York and I remember like she probably didn't have too many like tutorials up yet. Fashion week. A week I went out with a bunch of my friends. I remember specifically seeing this girl with like this hat and I was thinking in my head she's so fine. I feel like I've seen her before. Little did I know it was Ray Ray the whole time. I was looking for a beautiful like red shade and I found it. Appreciate ya. I'm gonna go in Friday on Black Friday. Like I was dead broke. Like and Ray had just come out with these palettes. These eyeshadow brushes. I felt like damn I'm like 54 bucks. And I was like bummed out because she had said on like her Instagram. I can't get these discounted. They just dropped Sunday. The day before Cyber Monday. She made an announcement. The palette and the brush with $35. I use this smudge brush to apply the Cover FX concealer. I find that using an angled brush is better. Tiffany, which is this shimmery shade. We're patting this. Go back into Friday. Connie with this smudge brush. I really intensify this look. Put on my Bombshell Cosmetica lashes. If you guys want like a full detailed review on these lashes, let me know. I did put on my concealer concealer, my lashes, and my eyeliner off camera. I love like a really dark contour. Going into Mocha, the dual blush bronzer blush. Okay, Mocha. We're warming up the face with Mocha. Digged into brownie bite. Let's be snatched. I don't know if this brush is the best for using brownie bite because you see this. You see that? Hold the bristles. Because I needed a more controlled contour. You know what I mean? Like, brush is so soft that I'm gliding. There's another brush, which is like an angled brush. This is more like not as soft or stern in a sense. And I'm gonna use that same smudge eyeshadow brush with Connie. Sunset in the middle. Friday in between that. Maybelline Great Lash Mascara. I'm gonna brush away any excess powder I have under the eyes blend out those brows because we still have that harsh concealer underneath the brows small tapered highlighting brush and of course I'm gonna go into radiant oh, ho, 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 ho. every day we lit eh, we lit hold up I'm OD and come back to y'all cuz I don't want my camera to tell me my card is full like radiant though like now I'm gonna put some of uh, French toast on top of that just to see what the hype is about if you haven't got that Ray Ray palette um you missed it now so this is the final product of this look If I had to give her a rating from 1 through 10, I give the palette a 10. I give the brushes an 8. I'm loving both products. For those of you who said the highlights were chunky, not chunky in my opinion at all. It glides on. And as you can see, I have that like wet, dewy look without so much work. So I messed with you, Ray. I don't know what you did, but hands down, y'all did it. Thank you, Ray. I wish that I had your lipstick. I would have been rocking your lipstick right now, but I'm in love with this palette. I see myself using this palette every day. Appreciate you. Thank you for getting us that Cyber Monday deal. I'm so thankful for that. Sometimes I can feel so unmotivated to put up videos because I don't have new products that are coming out. I won't always be doing these type of videos, but if you guys enjoy these type of videos, please let me know. Feedback 
is always appreciated on this side. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Introducing Jinx and I'll put them out like two cents.